I'm Jay Horton. I make movies that make money. This is how. In the past, I've referred to Film Hub as a marketplace, and I've given the impression, hell, I believe I've straight out stated it, that they don't actively pitch films to platforms, but simply place them on a list of avails to the platforms. Turns out this is not really true. And it also turns out that they do in fact watch my channel. <laughs> Um, I got this email recently from the CEO of Film Hub that explains this a little better and why they no longer refer to themselves as a marketplace. Just watched one of your recent videos and wanted to clarify something. From a branding perspective, we actually ditched the term marketplace. It becomes too confusing to filmmakers and they feel that we're not actively pitching their titles to streaming channels. See. Every distributor operates as a marketplace. A marketplace by definition is just a two-sided platform of supply and demand. In the case of distributors, it's content and streaming channels. FilmHub does in fact have a dedicated sales team that is constantly talking to our streaming channel partners and is working to get as many titles as possible selected by streaming channels. If we just had a title available in a long list, it wouldn't make it anywhere, unfortunately. The big difference between Film Hub and traditional distributors is we utilize technology and tools to make the team much more efficient, and then they're able to provide data to streaming channels to help them pick films. Traditionally, streaming channels have to go back and forth with distributors by email or phone to negotiate a title. With Film Hub, they can click instant order and they get it automatically in three to five days and can chat with a sales rep backed up with data to help the streaming channels better figure out what's best for them. For instance, we recently had a Roku channel that declined 150 out of 200 titles that we submitted to them for review. We then armed them with extra data to further show how well these titles had been performing elsewhere, and they came back and selected 140 of the 150 titles that they had previously declined. The real key here is that we automate their selection and delivery process. One click to order and deliver, which, to the best of my knowledge, no other distribution company is doing. That is why we now call ourselves a distribution platform. Of course, we also believe that a distribution platform or company shouldn't have the exclusive rights from a filmmaker to accomplish getting their films onto streaming channels, so we continue to remain non-exclusive. Okay, so there you have it. Film Hub is a distribution platform, not just a marketplace. And it sounds like they do have systems in place to actively pitch titles. So really the lines between traditional distribution and a distribution platform like FilmHub are becoming blurrier. And keep in mind, FilmHub is still evolving. Just a few weeks ago, they drastically changed their payout schedule. And I've heard through the grapevine that another big announcement is gonna be made in the next month or so. And look, I wanna clarify something personally myself. I publish videos about FilmHub because I like them. I've been using Film Hub for several years now, I've made a lot of money through them, and I know many others that now do the same. My videos on Film Hub are not sponsored by or paid for by Film Hub, though I wouldn't turn them down if they were to offer. Full transparency now, I am an affiliate. I do get a small percent of Film Hub's side of the back end on any filmmaker's films that start their accounts through my links. So. Take that how you will, I do have some skin in the game, but I'd be making these videos and saying the same shit whether I was an affiliate or not. All that said, not everyone is absolutely in love with Film Hub. It, like any other business, is not perfect. Check out this video here and see some other filmmakers' issues with Film Hub. But whatever you do, keep making movies.